the science behind skyscrapers. Skyscrapers define modern cities. They touch the clouds, defy gravity, and reshape skylines. But what keeps these towering giants from toppling over? How do they stand tall against wind, weight, and time? Let's explore the science behind skyscrapers. The challenge of building tall. The higher a building rises, the more it must fight against gravity, wind, and its own weight. A skyscraper isn't just a tall building, it's a vertical ecosystem, engineered to stay stable, safe, and functional. The key lies in balance, strength, and flexibility. The core, the building's backbone. Every skyscraper has a structural core, a strong vertical spine made of reinforced concrete or steel. The core houses elevators, stairwells, and utilities, but more importantly, it resists bending and twisting from wind or earthquakes. It's like the skeleton of a living organism, providing both support and stability. The frame, a web of strength. Early skyscrapers used steel frames, a revolutionary idea from the late 1800s. Instead of thick stone walls, engineers built a skeleton of vertical columns and horizontal beams. This frame carried the building's weight, allowing walls to be lighter and windows to be larger. That's how cities like Chicago and New York reached the sky. Fighting the forces. A skyscraper must survive three main forces. Gravity, which is pulling everything downward. Wind, which is pushing sideways, especially at high altitudes. Earthquakes, shaking the foundation and twisting the frame. To resist this, engineers use load paths, routes that safely carry forces from top to bottom and into the ground. The secret isn't making skyscrapers rigid. It's making, it's making them flexible enough to move without breaking. The foundation, deep and strong. Skyscrapers don't just stand on the ground, they anchor into it. Engineers dig deep to reach bedrock using piles or caissons that transfer loads securely. Some foundations go more than 60 meters deep. The higher you go, the deeper you must build. Wind engineering, the invincible battle. At great heights, wind is a major threat. Strong gusts can sway buildings by several meters. To undo this, engineers design aerodynamic ships that cut through air rather than fight it. Some skyscrapers, like the Tepel 101, used tuned mass dampers giant counterweights that sway opposite to the wind, keeping the tower stable and comfortable. Materials that make it possible. From high strength steel to composite concrete and carbon fiber, modern materials make skyscrapers lighter yet stronger. Glass cutting walls reduce weight and let light in, while new insulation materials keep energy use low. Innovation in materials has turned skyscrapers from heavy blocks into elegant engineering arts. The future, smart and sustainable skyscrapers. Tomorrow's skyscrapers will do more than stand tall. They will think and adapt. Smart sensors will monitor wind, stress and temperature. Green facets we clean the air. Integrated solar panels and wind turbines will make them energy self-sufficient. The next generation of skyscrapers will rise higher and live sustainably. In conclusion, what's the science behind skyscrapers? It's a blend of physics, materials, design and imagination. Every tall tower is a story of human ambition. Proof that with the right engineering, we can reshape the sky itself. Engineering doesn't just reach new heights, it defines them. Please like, share, and subscribe.
subscribe for more videos that reveal the engineering behind modern marvels. Essentials ENG explaining the structures that shape our world.